We have gathered here today together to celebrate the marriage of Patrick, Keyes, and Neil Harrison. The joining together of two people in matrimony is one of the most joyous of all celebrations, since it marks the public acknowledgement of enduring love and commitment. What greater thing is there than for two people than to know that they are joined together to help and strengthen each other and their community, and to share with society the fruits of their love. The Roman Catholic monk once wrote, Thomas Merton wrote, my community is every person on every street in every city of the world. Community defined by love, not by rules, not by law cannot be regulated and bound. Community alive with possibility. For Patrick and Neil, it was love at first sight. Anyone who has experienced love at first sight knows that it isn't love exactly, but it is something magical and important and worthy of our attention. And it shows us that once in a while, right in the middle of an ordinary life, Love gives us a fairy tale. <clears throat> if you, Patrick, and you, Neil, have duly considered this relationship in which you're about to enter, and if you are willing to be married, please demonstrate that desire to me here today and to your witnesses by joining hands. And make sure you join hands beforehand. <laughs> She would run away from me to <laughs> the two of you. <laughs> we will now do the spring ceremony. Um, I will begin with Neil's ring, please. And repeat after me. <laughs> Neil, with this ring, Neil, with this ring, I be wed, I be wed, and pledge to you my love. I pledge to you my love. to you, my love. Now look at your rings. The rings are circles. A circle has no beginning and no end. It is a sign of wholeness and of homecoming, of perfection and of peace. These rings you give to each other today are a symbol of the union in which your two lives are now joined. It's an endless circle. And you think about it, no matter where you go, you will return to one another. We will now do our vows. Please smile. <laughs> there, that's better. Now he looks happy. <laughs> Patrick, please repeat after me. I take you, Neil, to be my wedded husband. I take you, Neil, to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To love, to nurture. To love, to nurture. And to grow with you physically, mentally, and spiritually. And to grow with you physically, mentally, and spiritually. For all the days of my life. For all the days of my life. I take you, Patrick. I take you, Patrick. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. To love and to nurture. To love and to nurture. And to grow with you physically, mentally, and spiritually. And to grow with you physically, mentally, and spiritually. For all the days of my life. For all the days of my life. Patrick, Neil, you've made, their, you've made your marriage vows to each other in the presence of witnesses. You've promised to go forward in your life together and to share your lives and good deeds with all of us. We now join together in wishing you a lot of health and a lot of happiness. Patrick and Neil, now that you've pledged yourself to each other in the presence of myself and the witnesses, by the authority vested in me by the province of Ontario and the Marriage Act, 
I now pronounce you husbands. <laughs>